Hello, my name is Craig Jones with Cobb Technologies. Today, we're gonna to be going over some simple fixes that customers should be able to do to help avoid service calls. Um, the very first thing we're gonna go over is lines on your copies, lines on your scans. Um, this happens to be the most common service call that we get, um, no matter the type of machine. And I'm gonna show you an example right now. So we're gonna start off by making a copy using your ADF, which will be similar on most machines. Doesn't really matter the brand. As you can see, you have a big fat line on your copies. So once you find out you have a line on your copy or your scan, and you use the document feeder, you're gonna to wanna to look to the left side. Beside your large piece of glass, there's gonna be a smaller piece of glass on your left-hand side. If you have copies that have lines on them or you have scans that have lines on them and you use the document feeder, this is gonna be what's gonna be dirty uh, nine times out of 10. As you see here, we have a demonstrated this could be ink, this could be white out. So we demonstrated a little small piece of tape. So you clean the glass, you can use a regular cleaner, Windex, um, spray it on the rag first, and then just wipe your glass down. Sometimes it, it can get on there um, pretty, pretty hard, no matter what it is. And you might have to actually scrape it a little bit with your fingernail if it doesn't come right off. But that can save you some time. Um, also, if you take your copy that you made and lay it on the glass where you can see it, normally the line will match or be in a general area with whatever it is that's on the glass. So we'll run another copy and we should be line free. All right, so no lines, we'll clean the slick glass. And if you talk to anybody in our, our sim center or a technician happens to call you and they ask you if you clean the slick glass, this is what they're talking about. Now let's say that you printed from your computer and you have a line. That's generally gonna require a service call. If you actually print it from your computer because the image is coming from your computer, it's not getting scanned in any way and you have a line. So unfortunately, that's probably gonna require a service call. But if you're copying from the feeder or scanning to your computer or scanning to your email and you have a line, that's gonna be normally something on the optics, on the glass. If you're copying from this part of the glass, the large part of the glass, and you receive a line, also that would probably be internal. And this should be the same on pretty much all of your copiers. Some copiers do have a second glass. If you're scanning double-sided, um, that would be located inside the document feeder. But most calls we get are for the front side only. Um, the back sides aren't used as often as you would think. So that should be for that.